Hola, señora. Hasta la vista. Oh, oh you look wonderful. <laughs> oh, well, that's honeymoon spy, isn't it, eh? Sun, sand, sea, you know. <clears throat> yes, is uh, Steve in your suitcase? Ah, well, I didn't let you know because I didn't want you to worry. Oh, no, what's he done? No, nothing, nothing. It's just, uh, well, him and Andy didn't really see a lot of each other, you know, what with me and Steve having a lot of lions. Mm. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, he's decided to stay on so they can spend a bit of time together. Right. Oh, well, to be honest, all that's been round here is loads of blue lights and funerals. That's the last thing he needed to come back to. Mm. Well, they had to talk him into staying, convince him our Amy was OK. Must have been awful. Well, I hate to say it, but at times like this, I'm really glad she's 50% her mother. Seriously? Mm. If Tracy Barlow is nothing else, she's a survivor. Yeah, well, she'll get what's coming to her anyway, won't she? I haven't even asked you how you are. How do I look? Well, you look great, but I meant how are you feeling? Excited. Nothing like a new broom to sweep away the rubbish. New... Flippy neck, Liz. You don't let the grass grow under your feet, do you? Oh, there's no time for that. Anyway, grass is for cows. Here, hey, you've got house guest. Yeah, yes, and she'll be very pleased to see you. It's, it's, it's been a difficult time. Yeah, I know. When I think how close we were to losing our Amy. <laughs> Come here, you. Mm -hmm. Thanks for all your messages. Mm -hmm. Listen. Everybody knows it was an accident. Even Steve. Especially Steve. So look at you. you tell me how was it? Make me blush if you think you can. Why didn't you return my calls? Because I knew you'd say it wasn't my fault, and it it has to be. Carl's family know it. Sophie knows it. They're grieving. Anyway, come on. Any update on Nick? Oh, yep. He and his preggers cougar are at their baby's first scan now. I'm sorry. 